Hey guys, it's Axel Reyes here and today we'll be reviewing the first battle pass of the game Apex Legends by Respawn as they've released the date Tuesday and 10 a.m. Pacific time according to Indian time it will be at 10.30 p.m. So let's not waste any time and let's head into it. So guys this is the season battle pass that we can learn about before they update the game. They are going to update it tonight and they tweeted it and they, are, they gave us the link through where we can see all the rewards and things we can learn about the battle pass. So let's see. So this is the season one battle pass wild frontier that what they named it. So you can actually buy the battle pass for 950 apex coin. It is a really great deal. When the data mining was people were saying uh, you can buy it for uh, I guess about $30 which would have been a bit too much but according to this 950 apex coins is a fair deal like it's a really good deal according to me so in a battle pass bundle you get uh, 25 levels unlocked instantly okay so you are paying around 2000 more apex coins for just 25 levels i don't think that's worth it that's a bad deal but that's all according to me how does the battle pass work? So as you play more, you grab more rewards. Okay, so you just have to play, grind and get more rewards. Wild Frontier Legend skins. So as soon as you purchase the battle pass, we'll be able to unlock these three skins. One for Lifeline, one for Wraith and one for uh, Mirage. So the skins are not that great. Like they didn't change or added anything into the character model, but it's okay these are the starting rewards so okay we can see if we get some get really good skin in the battle pass okay so the battle pass rewards earn over 100 unique items throughout the season everything you snag before the seasons over is yours to keep okay so what they actually mean by it if uh, you earn you can earn as much as you want but only before the season ends as soon as the season ends they'll be updating their battle pass I guess so at level 2 you'll be getting a triple take skin okay then a uh, hemlock skin okay then a banner introduction banner for Bangalore hmm. seems nice then some apex coins then bloodhound season 1 kills and then a prowler skin hmm the prowler skin is good okay some more apex coins experience another frame uh, I guess this is a longbow skin at level 14 I exactly can't confirm but I guess let's assume that's a longbow skin okay then mirage introduction I exactly don't know what this level 15 is like you get to show that you are on level 15 of the battle pass I guess okay then at 16 uh, then some more apex coins another frame spitfire skin okay apex coins experience a mozambique skin and this is a new apex pack Hmm, they colored it in purple, violet. So, let's see what the different color means in the game. Then we have introduction for Pathfinder, uh, Mirage starts. Then this is a Kraber skin, okay. Then E8 skin, introduction for Caustic. Some more Apex coins. Hmm. More Apex coins. Then this is a Flatline skin, Caustic season 1 kills. Okay, Apex Coins, Experience, another Apex pack. Oh, so, so this is a normal Apex packs, I guess. This one, not the purple one. Purple one is something special, I guess. Then another Alterator skin. Hmm. Then introduction for Gibraltar. Apex Coins, Peacekeeper skin. Hmm, this, okay. Till now in the battle pass, I guess this, peace, this Peacekeeper skin is good. Like, really good. Better than the rest of the skins. And I would like to change your mind. This Prowler skin is the be is better than the Peacekeeper. So one good skin that we have in the battle pass right now. Uh, just ac it's according to me. And then Apex pack, uh, Spitfire skin again. I guess introduction for Wraith. Hmm. The this can be a Havoc or a Mastiff skin. Hmm. I'm confused between those. Then this is a P20 skin. Okay, uh, P20 is good, finally. <laughs> Introduction for uh, Bloodhound. Then, okay, so this one is Havoc and that one was Mastiff. I guess, right? Yeah, it had to be. 
then uh, 99 skin apex pack introduction for the new champion octane so yes guys uh, with the new battle pass they are going to release their latest champion octane in the game uh, you guys can check his ultimate in the game like there is uh, are some jump pads around the market area and they actually did reveal the abilities of octane which are really good so then we get a uh, re45 skin then again another space special apex pack with the yellow color okay we'll see what you get from that then some experience uh, apex pack and a g7 scout skin hmm and at the last tier we have introduction for lifeline a 301 skin and a havoc skin so the havoc skin is actually really really good but if these are all level 100 rewards i'm not really satisfied uh, with all the tiers because like we didn't get a really good champion skin neither do we have a really legendary uh, weapon skin they should have added at least one legendary skin for one champion and one or two legendary skin for weapons well the havoc skin really looks cool but uh, this is a battle pass people are paying 950 apex coin for these they should have uh, put more effort into the skins and they could have released them but it's okay uh, it's the first battle pass they can update as soon as they update the like they when they're going to release the second battle pass they might have some really good skins for us so let's hope for that okay so even if you don't buy the battle pass you'll be able to earn some rewards which will be one wild frontier legend skin uh, the octane one i guess then you'll be having five apex packs and 18 stat trackers so these are the free rewards okay free rewards are not that good great but yeah then uh, never good in any game ready to jump in so what do you say in that 950 apex coins for battle pass and for the bundle you have to pay 2800 apex coins uh, as i see people won't be paying 2800 apex coins for the bundle just to unlock 25 extra levels just don't it's waste of m your money how do i have a ba buy the battle pass what happens if i buy a battle pass late in the season you'll instantly unlock the rewards of that current level that you are at of the battle pass can I keep leveling my season 1 battle pass after the season ends? No. Do I keep the stuff after the season ends? Yes. And there are some free rewards. So guys, this was... So the overall review of the battle pass is like... It's... The rewards are not that great. The skins are not that good. Like they're decent, but not good. Accord, like not to a level of a battle pass. As you can see, Paladins or Fortnite. The skins are really improving. Like their skins are right now at another level but uh, the deal is for 950 apex coin that's not a really bad deal so let's hope that uh, respawn brings some really good skin and really good updates in the next battle pass all we can do is hope for the best and let me know what you guys think about the latest battle pass or the latest champion and what do you guys think about the new update let me know all that in the comment section and i'll see you in the next video bye bye peace